Welcome to this video. We are talking today about the new Alfresco Search Enterprise 0.0 release. This product is enterprise only and it's available to be used from ACS 7.1. But before moving on, let's review all the different options Alfresco is providing as search engine. Search Services 2.0 is the open source product available for both community and enterprise. Core searching features are provided by Solar Sys.Sys and when using ACS Enterprise version, additional capabilities for large deployments like sharding are also available. Search and Insight Engine 2.0 is only available for enterprise customers. This product provides reporting capabilities to search services including a JDBC protocol to get results from Solar and also integration with some tools like Apache Zeppelin, Excel or Tableau. And finally, Search Enterprise 3.0 is an enterprise product uh, that provides searching capabilities but using Elasticsearch 7 instead of Solar 6. Additionally, this product doesn't require a customized Elasticsearch deployment since the features are provided using a service named Elasticsearch Connector that can be used with any standard Elasticsearch server. Let's start discovering this new Search Enterprise product by describing its design. Alfresco Search Enterprise Architecture is different from the one used for Search Services. While Search Services was indexing the repository into Solar, Using a REST API invocation polling process, Search Enterprise consumes repository messages to populate the Elasticsearch index. Search Enterprise includes three main processes. Lib indexing that populates Elasticsearch index by consuming events from Alfresco Active and Queue. Reindexing that populates Elasticsearch index by reading information from Alfresco database and searching that maps Alfresco search syntax into Elasticsearch to get requested results. Lib indexing is the regular mode recommended for environments with a complete Elasticsearch index. And every time an event uh, related with metadata and permissions is produced by Alfresco repository, the Alfresco Elasticsearch connector component consumes that event from the Alfresco Active and Queue and creates the indexing request to Elasticsearch. If that event also includes content changes, Alfresco Elasticsearch Connector creates a new transformation request message and allows the text to be indexed from Alfresco SART Firestore. And finally, the new indexing request to update the notice sent to the Elasticsearch server. Reindexing component is designed to populate an Elasticsearch index from scratch and to add missing nodes to that Elasticsearch index. This approach is recommended for upgrading or migration processes. Since in this case, Alfresco repository includes existing information that needs to be updated to Elasticsearch index. Alfresco Elasticsearch connector gets metadata and permissions information from Alfresco database and create the indexing request for Elasticsearch server. As we have seen before, text from content is extracted using the Alfresco uh, transform service that is asynchronous. Once Elasticsearch index is fully updated, the indexing mode can be used. And finally, searching feature is provided by Alfresco repository. This service is translating the Alfresco search syntax like FTS or Lucin into Elasticsearch searching request, and it's also translating those Elasticsearch results into the expected format for the UI applications. Additional details are provided in the official documentation for search enterprise, but we are going to explore now a simple Docker Compose deployment so we can test the basic features of this product live. Alfresco Search Enterprise Deployment Project is available in GitHub. This project includes 
includes a sample Docker Compose template to deploy Search Enterprise Field Studio with ACS 7.1. Remember that you uh, need Enterprise Key Systemer credentials uh, to use these Docker images since they are only available in our private Docker registry. If you are a customer but you don't have uh, these credentials, please contact our support channel uh, to get that. This is a regular Docker uh, Compose template for ACS 7.1, uh, but including some search and enterprise configuration. The, the first configuration change happens in the Alfresco service. We have to set the search subsystem as Elasticsearch and also some additional information for Elasticsearch server. Um, Elasticsearch and Kibana, as standard services, are also declared. So we can use both for indexing and testing, and testing purposes in our deployment. Search and enterprise services for living indexing feature are connected to Elasticsearch, ActiveMQ, and Transform Engine services. This service may require an external mapping file in order um, to map all the prefixes and URLs from the content model. But if you are using the default ACS configuration with no additional uh, model on that, you can skip this step. Redexing service has been included to show every option together, but this component can be also used as a command line application. In this case, Redexing service is waiting till the Alfresco repository is up using a simple shell script, including Redexing folder. Once everything is up and ready, Redexing is populating the Elasticsearch index so the system is ready to be used. Note that we are using also our customized mapping file for the content model in this Redexing service. Let us start now this deployment uh, to see that live. Once the system is live, we can see how the indexing service updated the Elasticsearch index right at, after our project started. The initial uh, 817 documents were indexed in around 6 seconds. Moving to the digital workspace application, we can uh, type a simple search in the UI and we can verify the results are the expected. Also, using Kibana, we can explore the Galactic Search Index to find out how the nodes were indexed. We are getting all the documents having uh, content inside, and we can see the properties indexed in the, uh, in for this specific document. We have metadata, we have also uh, permissions, and the content. From this point, Every time we are uh, adding or modifying, um, even removing a document in the Alfresco repository, Elasticsearch index is updated by using the lib indexing service. If we create a new document like this one, we can just verify that this document with this name is uh, indexed in the Alfresco uh, in the Elasticsearch index. If we remove that or modify that, we are going also to check that Elasticsearch index has been updated so that the document is not there anymore. Finally, remember also to check unsupported features for search and enterprise 3.0 since this product is being developed and the current version doesn't cover all the features provided by the previous search services product. I hope that was useful and enjoyed testing the new approach for search within the Alfredo platform. See you next time.